What's up guys, it's your boy Peter Tracy here, back at it again with another video. Today I'm gonna show you how you can create this really cool slow motion video. Today is gonna be a little bit different, normally we use always TikTok for the videos but today we also gonna use Instagram reels this is pretty cool I will probably do an extra video on that how you can use that but I already said too much and let's get started for today you need two things and these are two t-shirts yes um, I would recommend one black and one white t-shirt for the shirt transition at the beginning and then afterwards what you also need is a few pillows where you can drop your phone and a mirror so we're gonna start and create this video in Instagram Reels. So you go over there and put on Reels and now you can start. So the first thing we're gonna do is that we're gonna come from the side and pull our shirt like this and start stop recording here. Now the cool thing is that if you tap on this sign here, you will see the last frame of your video. So this will help us like Now we can align pretty good again here like this and start recording when we are here again. Now we have to think about an easy transition. I pull my shirt away and, pull, and then I'm gonna pull it over the screen, over the camera really close. Make sure everything is covered. And pull it over the shirt and stop. Now if it's not perfect, the cool thing is it's not the problem anymore. You don't have to record it again if it's not like right on the point because now when you click here, you can edit everything. Now first of all, we have to watch the video if it's quite okay. Yes, so you see that the first part is a little bit too much. So no problem, we can go back, go here, and then click on the scissor and we can edit it. So for about, let's say, here. So tr we're gonna trim it. Just trim it to the section where, it, where it's perfect and then you're good to go. Now we have to do the second part with the slow motion. For this now, you also need two shirts and you also need a lot of pillows or a lot of clothes or a blanket where you can drop your phone. I use my pillow for this and you just lay it on the floor and then just drop your phone. When you record this part right now, you have to make sure that you record with a high FPS rate, like for example 120 or 240 FPS, because the more FPS you use, the slower the video can be. Go to the normal camera and then go to slow-mo. Now in the settings you can change the FPS. For right now as you can see at the right top you can see it's 240 FPS and when you click on it it's 120. Um, you can choose which one you want to use. As, as we see in the video you take your you, sh you start recording, take your shirt, pull it away and then let your phone drop onto your pillow not on the floor. When you record the second video you have to do it in reverse. The video should start with the hand in front of the camera because I will reverse the video. So we're gonna start here, go back with our hand and then let it drop for the second video. Now you can start editing. You can do this really really easy. And it's gone. Now if you have an iPhone click on the video you just recorded click on edit. Now you can edit where the slow motion should start. Start with the slow motion when we start dropping it. You can also do the same in Kine Master. It's kind of the same. You just take the part that should be in slow motion and tap on time and then slow it down. It's kind of the same principle here. We're just gonna start where we want to slow it down. This is where the video starts and then we throw it and then we let it drop like this. We want to start slow motion when we let it drop. Like for example, right here. All right, now we can also trim it at the, at the beginning. The start of the video should be when we pull our shirt in front of the video. And at the end, we're gonna stop when the phone is falling down here. All right, now the second video, we're gonna start when our hand is in front of our camera and the end is when it's dropping down till here. Whether we wanna start the slow motion here and it's falling to the ground here. Perfect, now we go to done. Then you have to play it backwards, the last video. You can do this in Canvas really easy, also in the time section where you do the slow-mo. And if you have an iPhone, you have to do this in iMovie. Nice. 
nice. Now you go to Instagram and add the video you just recorded and export it at the end. So, for me it's gonna be this one here. We add this at the, at the end and then add. Then you're gonna add some music to it. The drop should come when it's slow motion starts and it's gonna look like this. Yeah guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. Also guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. There we will continue with the cool content. There you will see everything behind the scenes. And also guys, don't forget to smash the subscribe button and click the bell so you can notified when I drop new videos or new tutorials. And I will see you the next time guys. Peace.